What up YouTube, it's your boy J Light. Just doing a quick video for you guys, showing you guys what I got. Um, it's a Reef Keeper 2 from Digital Aquatics. Um, I picked this up off of a guy on Reef to Reef. Um, he was selling it for I think a hundred bucks. Um, I just threw him an offer of fifty. Um, just to see if he would bite on it and he did so got this for actually you ended up going for fifty five dollars so got it for fifty five dollars fifteen dollars shipping um really happy with this see it's it's a little beat up but I mean I guess you get what you pay for so I'm pretty psyched about this I uh Actually got it yesterday. I have um, pretty much the whole power strip filled right now. Um, I'm gonna hang that probably either tonight or tomorrow. I got tomorrow off, so I'll probably do it tomorrow. Um, that's sixty or seventy six right now. Uh, so I have it set to shut off the heater at seventy eight degrees. The uh, pH I don't think is completely accurate. Because I'm pretty sure you're supposed to keep that moist at all times to like keep it accurate. But it was not, so I'm not really sure. The temperature I know is accurate because I just bought that probe. Even though the guy said to buy one and it came with one. But I got two, so whatever. Um, what else? This, this thing's awesome. I'm so glad I got this. Um, puts me a little bit at ease with everything it's a little outdated I'm pretty sure you could uh, I might hook it up to my computer soon to uh, see if I could get any firmware updates or anything just to see you might as well um, yeah so I if you don't have a controller I definitely recommend you get one I've had it for not even a full day yet I'm already uh, loving this thing. Just the things you can do with it. Turn pumps on, turn pumps off. Um, if the tank gets too high, you could turn certain things off. Um, what else? A whole bunch of stuff. It's really cool. Um, I'll probably do an update and do a video of how to program it and everything once I uh, get to use it a little bit better. But uh, for now, this is all I got. Um, I'll probably show you guys it all set up tomorrow. So, yeah, that's about it, guys. Um, I'll show you guys the scape quick. I changed it up a little bit. I like it a lot. This is probably going to be the permanent scape. Um... Pretty sure I'm going to leave it like this because there's so much room on top for SPS. And then there's some shaded, um, not completely exposed areas for uh, LPS and SPS that don't need all that much light. So yeah, that's about it guys. Um, I'll probably have a video coming out a little bit later on in the week. So uh, yeah, later guys.